I didn't do it. I really didn't. They must know I'm coming. I can't remember if I filmed anything today, and if I have, I can't remember what I filmed. I just got through the uh, same job that I was doing the other day, rewiring, <laughs> lots of fun. Oh my gosh, it's a nightmare. Try sorting out spaghetti when spaghetti has like the different ends that need to be brought, never mind. Anyway, you give me, it's like spaghetti. Let me just leave it at that. I wanna switch to the GoPro real quick. I'm not gonna do any, any more of the, the high speed stuff. Uh, right now anyway because i've done that the last couple days i don't want it to get boring but i am going to switch to gopro and show you something before it gets too dark this is what i wanted to show you guys this is the world that we live in and this is the one that i drive in <laughs> so there is your 360 big face i know there is your 360 of life right now breathe it in because it's so good to be alive because the other option is not too much fun i i'd say it's probably i i don't know personally i've never died before and lived to be able to tell about it which is funny but yeah oh i need to find i need to find gas i need to find a radio shack Ugh. oh look old house Oh, oh, that's what, since I've got the GoPro, I'll just continue. That's why I wanted to say also is the house that I'm working at, I'm, I'm actually in the garage, which is really nice, but they've got a bunch of Halloween stuff and I'm not going to uh, film the inside of somebody's house because, you know, that's just wrong to do, especially without asking. Um, and the reason why I would film somebody's car, like when I was working, is because that's something that people can see. If they lean in the window of the car, you know, they can see that. Um, but you can't necessarily see inside somebody's house, so I want to make sure that I don't violate that, uh, uh, that, that whatever. I can't, I can never think about what I want to think about. I can never say what I want to think about when I want to think about it. Anyway, sorry, squirrel, uh, they had a bunch of Halloween stuff, and it was so cool. I wanted to film it. They had some, like, gothic fencing with orange lights on it. They had a couple of skeletons just hanging around, like there's a head on the workbench, and oh, it was just so cool. So there you go, you, you can visualize it with my description. And I picked the perfect time to head home on a Friday night, rush hour. I think we're gonna miss the awesome sunset. So I'm filming now, but there's really nothing to see right now. I'm hoping that we'll get on the other side of these trees and you guys will be able to see the awesome set that is the sun. The sun of the set. Ooh, oh, there's a little peak. There's a little peak of it. Just a little peak. That's all you get. And now there's trees again. And there's the difference. You guys can see what's left of the sunset on the other camera. Actually, now you can't again. Dang, trees. The one thing that makes Washington so pretty is the trees, and I'm complaining about them. And the rain. The rain makes Washington beautiful also. And I, especially since I'm out doing this whole uh, road, not roadside, but this whole mobile mechanic thing. Um, yeah, I'm going to be complaining a lot about the rain this winter. Oh boy. But it's okay because as long as I have a beautiful sunset like this every once in a while, even if I can't see it. Oh, there you go. Look. Oh, yeah. Let me zoom in post edit. Ah, yeah, pretty. As long as I have sunsets like those, I'll be okay. Maybe just a little wet. Wet, but okay. And it's winter time, so I'll be cold. So wet, cold, and okay. Unless I get sick, and then I'll be wet, cold, sick, and still okay, as long as I don't die. Then I'd be wet, sick, cold, and dead. <laughs> yes, the title of this vlog, death. <laughs> like this guy. Ah, we should name him like Elmer or Gertrude or Bones. We can name him Bones. And we could get him like one of those small little name tags that says, hello, my name is, so that Troy doesn't forget that his name is Bones or whatever we decide to name him. What's up, dude? You're on YouTube. Haha. <laughs> Some of you may wonder, Troy, you don't do something Halloween all the time. Why not? And I will tell you because Sometimes I'm doing other things like working and making money and going to the bank and I'm about ready to go and get gas too. I didn't have any beans last night so I didn't have any gas 
that way, but I don't think that would have worked anyway. No, it really wouldn't have. You know, if I had the fart machine right now, I'd be making gas sounds, but the car in the background, the lowered Honda just did it for me anyway, so. Okay, um, so, yes, uh, I'm at the bank, I'm done here, gas, and then I have to go to, oh, that's a long story. It's boring. You guys don't wanna know about everything, do you? I mean, cause I, I stopped by Lowe's, well, maybe you saw that, maybe I filmed that, I can't remember. I stopped by Lowe's this morning, I got a tool, I didn't need the tool, um, but I still need a piece for another tool that I have, so I have to stop by Radio Shack to, to get a, a replacement bit for my soldering gun, and, and then I've gotta go to Lowe's and return the tool. All before I go get back home tonight, because I don't like having money out that I don't need to have money out for. Does that make sense? I will say this too, because I'm just thinking this right now. You guys are smart, each and every one of you is smart. Each and every one of you means something to somebody. So I want you to be happy and smile, pat yourselves on the back, and just know that somebody out there loves you. We're all important, each and every one of us. Don't don't ask me why I just said that. I just, I felt the need because sometimes we have to be reminded of that fact. Okay, Troy's preaching is done, but hopefully it did some good. On second thought, it's late, or it's getting late, it seems late, and I'm tired, and I'm hungry. I haven't had anything to eat today, at all. Nothing, absolutely nothing. So I'm gonna grab something to eat, and we're gonna get home. We're also gonna be getting home with a full tank of gas, look at that. I love to see that move me a bit. I love, <laughs> I don't know what I love. I love seeing that needle go, look how high that's swinging. Woo, we are full. Pizza bone. One for you. Got one to catch. And one for me. This is like when you're so hungry you don't have time to sit down. It's just like, you know something? I'm eating now. Oh. And yes, it's pizza. I don't want to hear it. It's healthy. It's got everything you need. Everything. You got the speed, mama. <laughs> okay, hold on a second. I will tell you guys that right now I'm rocking out to like 80s butt rock. I don't know, was Great White? Yeah, Great White was 80s, right? Like 87-ish, something like that maybe? Business cards. I'm printing business cards right now. I've already done like all my managerial crap for the night and set up scheduling and all that fun stuff. And fuck Buffy's like, let's go outside, let's play. So we're going to do that. We're going to do that after I get these printed. Um, God, business cards are such a pain in the freaking butt. And... It costs like $20 to get all these business cards, and then I have to print them myself. And, and the ink that it takes to print all this stuff. I know, the ink. It takes ink to print the business cards. Oh, oh, oh she almost bit you guys. And then I asked them how much uh, for business cards, and they were like $29.95, and I'm like, for like almost 500, and I'm like, and I know that you guys are gonna tell me to go to Vista Print. And that's where I got my business cards for, for Hellmouth, so I'm, that was her yawning. So I don't know why I didn't do that. I don't know why I'm walking around with this piece of paper in my hand. Oh yes, because I can only print one at a time. Oh, because I drop it. <laughs> no, I can, gosh dang it. I can only print one at a time because it jams. Because it's like thick cardstock, and oh, it just what a pain in my butt. Anyway, so I'm gonna finish doing this, and then we're gonna go for a walk. Do you wanna go for a walk? No? You wanna go for a walk? She's like, yeah, of course I wanna go for a walk. What a stupid question, of course. Okay, more 80s butt rock, more business cards, and then we're going for a walk at nine o'clock at night because it's dark now. I know, it's dark now, isn't it? It's very dark, very spooky. Spooky and dark, dark and spooky. She's like, let's go. Are you ready? You wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? We're gonna go for a walk, because business cards are done. Look at that, look at that stack of business cards there. And we're gonna go for a walk, oh my gosh. I'm not sure if she knows that we're actually going for a walk, or if she, uh, I don't know what I was saying. What was I saying? You don't know, I don't know if you're excited just because of my tone of my voice, or because we're actually going on a walk. Oh, is that what you want? Is this what you want? You are a smart dog. You're a smart dog, you want that? You wanna go for a walk? Wow, this is so interesting, it's only 9.30. 9.30 and look how dark it is, look at this. I can remember at 9.30 in the summertime, some people are still mowing their yards. 
but everybody has to be very quiet because for some reason it's very quiet outside. I don't know why it's quiet outside. Buffy, it's quiet outside. It's quiet. Quiet. You know, I would love to get the GoPro and get a doggy strap for her and put the GoPro on her. I just think that'd be cool. And then go out in the backyard and it'd be like Buffy view. <laughs> anyway, um, oh, let me take a moment real quick and talk about Patreon. Uh, a couple things coming up. Well, first of all, um, Monday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, we have the uh, viewing of Ghostbusters on you now. The link is down below. And also we have uh, Patreon, which uh, the contest is going to be here in a couple days within the week for October's Patreons. Um, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, all you have to do is pledge a dollar for the channel and you can enter in the awesome contest. Link for Patreon is also down below. Oh my gosh, I'm out of breath. Why am I out of breath? Oh, because I'm out of shape. That's why. And I try to pass it off like I'm whispering, like, okay, be quiet. I'm really out of breath, but I'm just whispering. Yeah. <sighs> so many smells, so little time. Want to see the old spooky school? The school that's definitely spookier at night. Or what used to be a school. It used to be a school. I don't even know what they have in there anymore. Wow. They left a lot of stuff in there. This would be so cool to come in here and haunt this up. Oh my goodness. God, that'd be so cool. And like they left that there too. I always think about doing a haunt here at the school. Just because it's so dang creepy, especially now that it's vacant. The grounds, they're starting to uh, not keep up the grounds anymore. So it hasn't been mowed in a while. The bushes are starting to get kind of, kind of creepy. Thanks for the memories. Oh, I gotta get a picture of this. Here we go. Maybe I can lighten it up for the vlog. <laughs> You're such a klutz. I'm not sure if you guys know this, but she is a total klutz. You'll sit there and you'll start patting her head and then she'll like start to, you know, go back so that you can pat her belly, pet her belly, whatever. And then you'll start doing that and she'll just like flop over and she'll be like, oh geez. So I want to sit down and I want to watch American Horror Story. It's not on tonight. I recorded it. So I want to get caught up. I want to relax for a minute. Relax. No, that's not relaxing. No more playtime. No more playtime. No more playtime. No more playtime. Look at this. Oh, oh. And she's off the couch. <laughs> okay, maybe playtime a little bit more. Well, here's something I usually don't show. I'm in the middle of the edit. So I've edited uh, five minutes and I've got, I don't know, like 17 minutes of raw material left to go. Um, but um, I'm get out here getting coffee, kind of like refreshing, give myself some, some more oomph to complete the edit and not fall asleep. And I have a question to ask her. Trick or treat? Trick or treat? <laughs> wow, don't know what that was. Trick or treat, trick or treat, trick or treat. Choose wisely. She chose treat. I'm not going to mention what time it is, and I'm not going to mention that we're going to do a quick COC. I'm not going to say a word about it. At all. It's a lurking dog. UK Han, whose line is it anyway? Rocks! I know, I miss that program. I'm not even sure if they have it on anymore. May I help you? <laughs> do you have anything to say for yourself? Are you going to say something? Apparently not. Uh, thank everybody uh, for your thanks and congratulations on season six. Um, I certainly would not be doing this if it wasn't for you guys. Not crazy like six years into this. No. Uh -uh. Borgex2679, hopefully you will have something prepared for six months and six days from now. Um, is that vlog 2000? <laughs> I forgot. I mentioned it a long time ago and then I have to look up to see when that is going to be again. But yeah, I should do something. <laughs> For that, oh my gosh. LJ Mike 1204, a new name for the dog. Barfy. Are you Barfy? 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 The Energized. 
You certainly have a loyal group of subs slash friends slash hellions, which shows what a genuinely great guy you are and how much you really mean to everyone. I wish you continued joy and success vlogging for many more years to come. Well, thank you very much. And it, it's it's absolutely true. You guys, you guys are awesome. Hey, I'm trying to do some camera work here. <laughs> Spooky Norris, that fart machine totally reminds me of the bog of eternal stench from Labyrinth. For those of you who are wearing headphones, sorry. Thank you guys for joining us and being a hellion. Happy haunting, see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to thumbs up, everything's down below. Make sure to follow us on Snapchat because I've done like a couple goofy things on Snapchat and also uh, Periscope. I'm hoping in the next day or two, she's such a love. I'm hoping in the next day or two to do some more spooky Mad Libs on Periscope. So make sure that you follow us there too. All the links are down below. Just click on show more. It's like she's trying, I'm not a Troy Jim. Are you happy now? She's definitely not a lap dog. Alright, <laughs> see you tomorrow. <laughs> Saved by the fart. Ow. Oh, God damn it. I seriously just did that. Oh, crap.